Hand-painted milk glass bottle with stopper. Hmm. Seven bucks. Okay. All right, well today we've got Laurel with us and we are standing outside at the Springfield Antique Center. Andrew had to run inside real quick, but we're gonna go meet him. And we're gonna see what we can find to buy and flip for a profit. Right, Laurel? Are you excited? She just woke up from her nap, so her excitement is limited. Yeah! Yay! Yeah. <laughs> Check out those lampshades, 145. This is what I was telling you guys. You know, the lampshades alone are worth some, worth some money, aren't they? Yes, they yeah. are. Oh, what do you see? Oh, that's not a puppy. Lots and lots of cases. Ooh, look at that. I'm referring to the yellow jar, of course. Ooh, pretty glass. All right, what else do we have? This is really neat with those feet. It's a little faded on the tag. I think it's probably been in there a minute. Oh, look, he's cute. Little hound dog. Viking glass basset hound. Interesting. I know somebody who might like that. It's 15 bucks. Yeah. Different fish as is. Yeah, we might have to get a key for that. Let's see if we can find anything else we need a key for, though. I always hate bringing them over just for one item. Yeah. 35 each. On those plates. Those are nice looking plates. I'm kind of digging this vase here for 20 bucks. I did not realize that Moorcroft made glass. I thought Moorcroft was a maker of pottery. So that is new to me. But I really like that. I love the hand painting in there. dog is taking a weebie. <laughs> Naughty dog. I love the hanger. I know, I know. That's the collector sign, I think. That's, That's pretty cool. too funny because Mary sent me a picture of one of those the other day. I'm like, I know, aren't those so cool? She's like, oh, I thought I was the first one to show you. <laughs> she was so excited. <laughs> like, I've seen a Tiger. few of those. Yes. Mom couldn't believe she's, she's has, she has one of these um, from, I think, our great-grandma. She couldn't believe that those are worth 20 bucks. She's like, 20 bucks? I'm like, yeah, you didn't know those were worth money. Oh, look at the vintage Harley Davidson stuff. That's cool. That's not really my jam. It's not, but it's good stuff. I mean, it's <laughs> desirable. There's a lot of it. It's gorgeous. All right, I'll take it. Thank you. Okay. Feel anything? I think you're good, and it's got the original sticker too. Awesome! That'll be great for Donna. Basset hound. Yeah, that's interesting. There's like lettering in the. That's cool. I wonder if it's a recycled piece. Interesting. Hmm? What the? Mess around with that? Yeah, we'll grab that. Okay. Thank you very much. Laurel, yeah. are you excited? <gasps> Yay! Oh! Yay! Oh! Oh! This will have you open the cases. Yeah! You just throw it at them and they open. Just kidding, don't do that. I forgot about all of these cases with the vintage Christmas and Halloween. It's kind of amazing. The putts houses. <laughs> There's some Funkos. Oh no, you dropped your keys. Now we can't get any cases. Let me help you. Here we go. Uh oh, you dropped them. Now it's a game. <laughs> yep, I gotta get that one. Oh my goodness. Hey, you guys. Yeah, no, so he's not, he's not wearing. The one I got had the pirate outfit. Uh -huh. This one doesn't. This one he's got his Superman shirt on. Oh my goodness. I think that's the one with the Superman shirt. There is one, there is one with the Superman shirt. I was checking out this gorgeous thing. I kind of love this horse for 25. 
It says it's Murano. He's very derpy looking though. I don't know. But he's only 25, so I think I'm gonna grab him. Look how derpy he is. <laughs> oh, he's got, got a, that adventuring he's in got his broken mane and tail. ears, I think. Mm -hmm. Yeah, his ears are broken. Oh. No! Oh. He is made in Murano. Polished bottom, $35. That looks to be in good condition. Make sure it's 35. Yes, 35. Okay, I'll take this one. There's another pretty piece of glass. I love the shape of it, um, how it's flared, but it's flat. And uh, you can see the peak here of, I would call that pink, but they have azurite blue. Um, it's 49. I think it's 10% off. Um, I think everything here is 10% off. So. I think that's a good price for that. I think maybe we'll get into that case. I usually like to have a couple cases in mind before I ask them to come over with the keys. Sixty-nine on that one in the back. Eventually we will get to the booths, but I usually start with the cases and then make my way there. Um, this is a Barbini. Um, twenty-five dollars on that. Oh my gosh, I just spotted that in the back for 48 Totally missed that one. But I just uh, flipped the switch. So I've got four items. E booze, e.g. booze. Mm -hmm. So that's why it's just a, it's a, a novelty that's thing weird. for me. Gotcha. Five. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's gorgeous. There's a B on it. <laughs> I'll take that as well. Okay. It's got the Bolo Conte. Yeah, it's Alfredo Barbini, 25. All right, I'll take that as well. Eyes down here. Signed Highland. Interesting. Put her to work. Interesting. <laughs> you sure you want to come down here? I'm gonna put you to work. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'll take this one as well. Okay. All right, thank you. I really love this artwork here. It says signed, numbered, silk screen, framed, one twenty four of three hundred. There is a signature there. I can't make it out though. It looks like a scribble to me. I really love that a lot. I love that a lot. My family was farmers in Fabius, New York. <laughs> so I feel like I need this. I need this and they, they're always on our case about having John Deere tractors because they always had the red tractors. Red tractors, right? <laughs> those are some crazy looking pieces of glass. Yeah, those are... Ooh, the rose medallion plate hiding back there. 30 bucks on that though. 25. I like the color combination. Oops, I can't forget my painting. Hello, gorgeous. How much are you? 75. Bristol dogwood face. Oh, so pretty. I like the crest on it. I have it. There's a repair. It was a little bit dead. I can't pay that to repair. That is adorable. <laughs> 1969 Litho. Her prettiness. Serves tea in the garden. That would look so adorable in Laurel's room. Her prettiness. Hmm. Maybe. Yes, I think we should. <laughs> look at that bunny. Pom pom tail. Her prettiness. He is so sweet. The little greyhound. He's probably, um, yeah, Sandy Cast. He's not in terrible shape either. He's just making me so nervous. They're almost always chipped up, but he's not. He's 40 bucks though. He's so sweet. <laughs> I absolutely love that bird looking thing up there. 50 bucks for that. 
I'm super tall, but even I can't reach it. So let's be a little bit more realistic and look down here. Hand painted milk glass bottle with stopper. Hmm. Seven bucks. Okay. I don't think that's the original stopper though. They may have done one of the things that you normally do and that's marry them together. They've been married, I think. That's okay. It was a nice marriage. All right, well, we have stopped here at this case. We've moved down another case aisle. Laurel is very interested in this one as well. I spotted this Vandermark bull. It is stunning, 75. It would be 10% off. What else is in here? That necklace in the back is gorgeous. I'll have to see what the price is on that. Little Morial gang in the back. And then we've got this over here. $35, which is great because if you it look here. It seems so random in that case of Barbies. I know. That's the best part. <laughs> it is random. It's probably why it's priced at $35. I'm curious if this green vase in here has a signature. I might ask them to take that out so I can get a closer look at it. Green Swirl Art Deco Vase. It is signed. Alright. Um, it's 10% off, right? Uh, yes. Okay. How much is it? 45? 95? 95? Yeah. If it's over 75, we can try to call the dealer. Okay. All right. If it, um... And then anything over $20 and a penny is 10%. Okay. If you pay by cash or check, and you get 7% if you pay by credit card. Okay. All right. Um, so you can make an offer if it's over. Okay. Um, can I offer 75 Sure. Okay. 75 on that. $19.99. Yeah, I'll take that as well. Okay. Yeah, that looks good. I'll take that. Thanks. Mm -hmm. This punch set is so cool. I absolutely love it. $300. This is something I would buy for myself. And I would only bring it out once a year for Christmas to serve eggnog. So fantastic. Wow. I love it. Look at all the Mickeys. It's a very weird looking fish. Bob Baker, wooden hound. It's kind of like a ceramic hillbilly hound. Doug Freights. Last flowers in the heads. Yeah, the one in the middle is nice. for that footstool. <laughs> Compress the chair a lot. There's the footstool. Glass face is on the floor. Oh, is it a glass face? Wait a second, I'm confused. It needs a lampshade. Freaks me out to see those on the floor because I'm always afraid somebody's gonna kick them. What do we have over here? Those are beautiful. 49. Ooh. How do we know they're German though? They marked? Ah, they are marked. They are marked handmade in Germany. That's how we know. So this booth here has a lot of fishing rods and um, rust and stuff. And I noticed a piece in the back. It was actually on that back shelf there. And uh, I just thought it was gorgeous. Art Deco. Marked on the bottom, 715. And 
some other scribbles that I can't quite make out. It's 95. And all it says is Art Deco Pottery Vase. A 95, it would be 10% off. I think I'm going to grab it. I, I tried Google lensing it. That's why I cleared off the shelf. I'm going to put everything back. Thank you. Um, but I think, I think that's going to come with me. Uh, when I tried Google lensing it, I got a lot of Navajo uh, double wedding vases. And that's not what this is. It does, however, look like little uh, chili peppers, doesn't it? Anyway, it's really cool. I think I'm going to take it with me. There's some other art glass pieces here. None of them are signed, though. So I don't think I'm going to mess with any of those. This is really the only one that was like, hey, look at me. So we'll take it. That is just absolutely stunning. My hands are full. I have to sit down. Oh, look, there's another one. 12 bucks? What's wrong with you? I love that color combination. Oh, there's a chip on the edge. That's, that's what's wrong with you. $12. Oh, I'm gonna buy it anyway. <laughs> it's pink, blue, and green. It's gorgeous. We're making an exception for that. I'm also gonna grab this for $38. Oh, it looks so much prettier on that black surface. The gold flake. Alright, alright. What else can we find in this booth? Let's stick those two here. I noticed there's something else down here, that's art pottery. What is this? I never thought I would see another one of these. Do you know what this is? <laughs> we sold the cat one out of our booth. This is like the same thing except they have it as a chipmunk head. Ours was a cat. And ours was painted. I didn't know that it wasn't like the only one ever. Now I know it isn't. Anyway, I was looking at this gorgeous beauty. Check glass lamp 120. That's shippable. You can come with me. Just tuck you here. You can come with me. What else do we have in here? That teddy bear is so sweet. Whenever I wash that and give that to Coral. Oh, it's $65. Maybe not. <laughs> I don't know if Coral needs a $65. He's just like, he's looking at me like, I was once loved. So he actually had like a little bit of a tear on the back of his neck. If I tried to wash him in the washing machine, he'd just tear apart. We'll leave him for somebody else. That thing's just weird looking. She'd probably have nightmares. His name's Grubby. He does look a little grubby. <laughs> oh, those are neat. Chalk Deco Face Plaques. I like those. And that's neat up there. I like this booth. This is a cool booth. Alright, well we're going to take the lamp with us. What do we have here? Mold blown yellow glass decanter with stopper, $35. Is that a Ponto mark on the bottom? I love the daisies. I wish we had some little glasses to go with it. That would just be the best. It is only $35. It's pretty reasonable. <laughs> there is no mama. Mama! <laughs> I like the coloring on that. Alright, I think this is the last booth that we're going to check out, and I guess we'll get back to you guys in the car with a total. I know it's nothing new, but it's so good to see you.